the RO member. But that hasn't been the case, and the approach is not working. The unilateral revoking of the Enbridge Line 5 easement remains unresolved, threatening the delivery of 540,000 barrels a day of petroleum products from Alberta and Saskatchewan that supplies over 53% of Ontario's crude oil and 66% of Quebec's. This line is critical. Has the Minister of Foreign Affairs met with the Governor of Michigan? The RO Minister. Madam Speaker, let me answer that question. Uh, I have not met with uh, Governor Whitmer. However, uh, our ambassador, our excellent ambassador, Kirsten Hillman in Washington, has had numerous conversations uh, with uh, Governor Whitmer, and we have a very active advocacy uh, um, uh, program underway to speak to people uh, in, uh, in the uh, states of Michigan, Ohio, and Pennsylvania. Remember? Can the minister tell us when he will be meeting with the governor of, Mi of Michigan? The RO minister. I'm sorry, um, Madam Speaker, I don't have any current plans to meet with the governor of uh, Michigan at this time. The RO member. This is critical. The governor, if the governor of Michigan is successful in shutting down Line 5, can the minister provide us with the plan that ensures that the 540,000 barrels will be delivered by other means? The uh, Honourable Minister. Madam Speaker, uh, we have been very active uh, to try to uh, make sure that uh, uh, this uh, pipeline is not closed down. Ultimately, we would like Enbridge and the state of Michigan to resolve their issue. But as you know, uh, we have also deposited, uh, uh, we have also transmitted uh, an amicus brief uh, to the courts so that they are aware of the fact. 